videos and we got another video. I am sorry that I haven't posted in a while. Um, I lost my filming phone and then, um, yeah, just a bunch of other things. And I kind of also want to have a bit of a break, but I ended up forgetting to film. Um, yeah, but if you're wondering who this is, this is one of my new mascots. Um, yeah, haven't fully given her a name. Why isn't the camera on? Right. Okay, white light now. Finally looks better. Wait, wait a second. Bingo! Looks so cool. Now, yes, we got another video, and, um, yeah, another video. So, I've missed you guys a ton. Um, yeah. If you're wondering why Vixie and Too Much Sugar around here, because I've decided to change their designs. Mm-hmm. Change. Mm-hmm. But this video isn't really about that. This is just a little thing. Um, yeah, this is going to be, um, it's going to be all about my recent Elvis customs. So, yeah, let's get on to the video. Um, this video will be basically showing all my recent customs, like you know, and some old customs. This is inspired of Play Studios. Um, if she's watching this, you are amazing. And any other LPS customizers or anyone who's watching this, you are amazing. Everyone's amazing. And yeah, let's get on to the video. So let's start with these two. Um, yep, we got some customs. We got these like toy um, bunny customs. These actually will be for sale soon when we get the um, SB account sorted. Well, when I get sorted. Um, these two will be set on sale together. Well, Two customs got this like ruined toy run with the wrong eyes, um, string, the smudge help. I actually painted a high that I wrote to my thumb on it so it looks smudge. I think I like this better one with a little heart marking. So golden eyes. I suppose these just would have to be my favourite because I just like the way I did the stitching effect, but it does look a little plasticky in face, so yeah, but let's move on to the other customs. I got this one. This one is actually really recent. Um, I did this like two weeks ago. Um, yes, two weeks ago. Um, I feel like I should change the lighting. Is this it? Green, this looks better. Um, we got this one. And we got this golden dog thing. I'm trying to do some patterns on his ears so it doesn't look like. Looks really weird. Um, um, he's got little eyebrows. Give him a bit of an expression. Um, he was made from a G5 LPS Dash Hound. Wait, no, was it a Dash Hound? Wait. Second. Yeah, it was a Dash Hound, I think so at least. Yeah, I was from the G5 LPS Dash Hound, um, the grey one. I actually only updated it, this isn't, this is actually its original colour, I have blue eyes. Ah, camera! Camera, why are you going in the lane? I think it doesn't like the lighting. Um, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, this is, um, a recent custom. This will probably be on for sale soon. Um, and yeah. Uh, so now that, ah. Yep, we got, no, we got the camera phone. Um, yeah. Here's another custom, you guys are probably familiar with this. Um, it's actually my channel pick. This is my Huggy Wuggy custom. Um, I got it from a G1 Greyhound LPS. Um, this will be not for sale because, well, this took me about four, I missed a very close to a whole week to make. Um, I had to do the face, I had to redo the face five times to get the right look. Um, yeah, the eyes look a little bulgy, a little too big, but at least it looks good enough. Um, this is it, what is it, like, buff clothes? Um, if you want to this is, this is actually string. Um, I did that with glue. Not hot glue, I did it with nail polish actually. Why did I say glue? But yeah, um, this is my Huggy Wuggy custom. Made from a Greyhound LPS. If you want in, let's move on. Ah. I got another racing custom. Um, uh, yes, I'm another LPS custom. Um, here we have. This one's actually really recent. He was made around the same time as this guy. Um, it was actually the same time to be honest. I got them a lot and um, I had already had them so I decided to customize them. This one has been full coloured. This is not the original colour. So it has, it's this um, uh, G5 LPS. 
weird dog thing. Um, I'm not good with dog breeds, I barely know them. Uh, but yeah, here we are, make my G5 LPS dog. Just to know, um, all the customs of LPS so far have been off done to LPS, so um, um <laughs> but yeah, that's not my name. Um, this is kind of like a, it's kind of derpy kind of dog. When I was doing him, I got the eyes wrong, and it looked like he was going a bit of cross eye. He reminds me of that dog from the Mitchells vs. Missions vs. the Mitchells. That um dog, I've got a photo up here. But yeah, it reminds me of that dog. So yeah. Um, oh, I should put the camera up now so it's proper for your audience to watch because you guys probably want to see it properly. But yes, um, this is him. And yes, now I've got another custom. If you've been on my channel for a while, you're probably familiar with this custom. Um, this is my head swap with a goat and a corgi. Very proud of this one. Um, yeah, I use magenta, glittery pink for ears. Sparkling, isn't it? Um, just got little white markings. I recently did some more white on the chest so it doesn't look that horrible. It's got a really rusty mix, it's got like... Yeah, but this one will probably, well this one will also be on sale for soon. When it is SD account is sorted. But yes! <laughs> um, but yes, this one is actually one of my favourites. Um, this is the generation of the LPS were... Uh, G1, generation 1, so yeah, um, with little hooves, little hooves. Alright, um, next, LPS custom, um, where is he? It's here, and it's not there, it's not there. from the sky. Well, why then? Tony that guy white, this is my um this custom. This one's kind of this one's like a recently an old. Like I made it in 2022 this year. But um it's just like um half ish old, like I made it in January ish. But yeah this is um from a long head cat generation one. You can't actually see can't see on the pillar. You guys can't see it, but I can see like a bra there's a, is it a blue magnet. The light is showing from the gold because like, the gold's supposed to cover it, but yeah. Um yes. Um he's a fluffy dude. Fluffy. Hmm. Fluffy. Hmm. Otherwise, um that's him. And whoop. Oh dear, where did he go? Oh there he is! Yes, to the lighting. I know you guys want some lighting. Wait a second. Do you guys like stars? There we go, you guys like stars, don't you guys? Yep. Um, yeah, we've got some stars. Oh, I'll spread above here so it looks better. It's cool, I might have to use these in a video. Wait a second. Should go. Oh, <clears throat> that has been the video so far. So yes, I hope you enjoyed and yeah, have a nice day and goodbye. So um scratch um wait guys um when I finished filming that I realized that this video is actually gonna be about drawing so yes this is gonna be really about this is just an extra part. This is gonna be really what I was about. So yeah. Um, I just open up my sketchbook for the drawing video. Ah, so many pages. There we go. There we go. Like a clean page. Now this will be a how to draw video, so yeah, you guys will love it. Now, I know you guys like your OPS, and me too, but... Today it's not going to be about that. We're going to be drawing a, a character. Yeah, we're going to be drawing two things. So yeah, um, this will be a 
video that's super duper amazing. This will be high quality. Um, I'll put the screaming bee, the yelling beaver right here and make it look professional. We need a moment of silence for him. And yes, that's the, um, the beaver. But yes, now let's do the drawing. Now, I know you guys. You guys probably won't need to draw Batman or some superhero. But me, I'm not a big fan of Batman. So today, we're going to be drawing. Pikachu. Yeah, Pikachu. We're drawing Pikachu. I completely forgot what I was going to draw, so now I'm just going to do Pikachu. So yeah, he's in the background here. Do you want to start with Pikachu in the background? So you guys match Pikachu? Ignore that he's dizzy, like I see. I just put him in the photograph because I like him. There he is. Pika. So today we're going to be drawing Pikachu. And you guys probably don't get a good sighting of us. At the end I'll lift the camera up and you can see. So, first off, you guys are going to need a pen. Or whatever some thing you have. Um, here's a whiteboard thing or a permanent marker. Doesn't really matter. Um, you can use one of these big guys. These biggies. And, ooh, they smell bad. Blech. Oh, sorry about that, guys. You've got to admit, once in your life you've smelt them. Everyone smelt something. You'll probably smelt your action figures. I'm not sure if this is actually an action figure or not. I can't, I don't, I'm not a big figure fan. Well, like, I know, like, I don't know how to tell the difference, but this Big Hero 6 character. Ooh. Favorite. One of his my favorite. But we're not talking about Big Hero 6. We are talking about drawing Pikachu. Pika Pika! <laughs> oh, that sounds so bad. <laughs> um, yes. Now, there's so many Pikachus you can choose from. You've got normal Pikachu or you've got Gigantamax. This thick boy. This one. Now, today. I am going to be drawing a thick Pikachu, the Gigantamax. So yeah. Now oh, why is he still there? There we go. He's gone now. Um. So let's start. First off, there oh, your camera's on the way. I'm gonna need to draw a nose. So first off, draw a tiny little. Just kidding. This is my empty ink pen. Oh damn it! Sorry guys, this video's gonna be long. I gotta be really long. So, do a little line like that. Do it long. Then do this. You can do choose what type of nose you want, but I'm doing like this little nose. So yeah, just gonna fill this in. Now second, we want this big mouth. So, do a line where you want the ends of the mouth to be. Then, be a pen. Do this. You can do an open mouth if you want. I'll be doing that, so. Do a big mouth like this. I actually don't know what Gigantamax's big mouth like inside of it looks like because I'm drawing him. Well, I don't have any references. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, so this is what you, it should look like so far. This little mouth. And if you want to, you can color it in. Um, with black, and that will be colored. This part will be colored in in five 
in five seconds it will be completely covered in five four three two one now you could do it with dark red or pink or any color that you think would look good or you could do it with like the real gigantamax pikachu mouth um i don't i haven't quite seen that many pictures of gigantamax pikachu but yep we got this little mouth and that's what needs to be done so next we need these cute little eyes now some commonly i do a sketch of where i want the eyes well you look like a gigantic pikachu like this guy he's got like his mouth there and we've got like a bit of a distance now i like to put my, my fingers like this about press my nail in to where i like 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 it but today i don't really want to do that so i'm just gonna Roughly assume it's like here. Um, you guys, this is probably turning a lot better than mine. Now, you do the other one, and that will be done. Three, two, one, and now, guys, I want to do my Pikachu with a mouth open and wink, so it looks extra cute. And yep, it's turning out cute. But now we need to do those big cheeks because this Pikachu cannot survive without these big cheeks. And at the end we will colour it, but mine colouring will be done in five seconds. Well, actually one second, but yeah. Um, don't worry about that. <sighs> okay, now we need those arms. Now, I like to say his arms would be about here, but you can do any deeper. Or you could do it like extra thing. You can choose where you are. This wants to be. If you didn't know, the Gigantic Max Pikachu has like these. Is it? I I'm, I'm, don't fully know if his name's Gigantic Max. But yeah, beware. I'm not a full Pokemon expert like other people. But the creators probably know fully how to say it. And yes, here we have his cute little hands. Now, I want to give him a bit of a chin by doing that. You don't have to, but I think it looks cute and it gives it a bit of a personality. If that makes sense. Oof. But yep, we got it so far. He looks so cute. Mm. I just want to... Boy, uh, I'm getting sidetracked. Sorry about that, guys. But now, we want to move on to the head. This is the first tutorial I've done in a while. So, there. We need that line. Got line. It should look like this so far. Um, really cute. Probably looks better when it's like this. Because it's... Yeah, so. We got that. We got this cutie. Now... Next up, we need those big round cheeks. This would be like thick, really thick, cheap Pikachu. And there's nothing wrong with a thick Pikachu. It's just it won't look proper. Like this isn't a fully stylized version. Like I'm just thinking of what it looks like. Oh, that looks. Oh dear. Um, uh, yeah, let's just, let, let's, let's share our problems with each other. My Pikachu's tooth, I recommend properly doing, like, the eyes a little closer and giving a bit of a, his cheeks a little inner, like, if that makes sense, because mine looks really, 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 a problem. Um, again... I'm doing this by memory, so this won't look 100% amazing. You guys are probably doing amazing way better than mine. Um, I'm just going to a bit of a leg. Just a bit of thigh. Nothing wrong with a thick Pikachu. It just looks a little. Yeah. I'm gonna give him a little. Now I know this is, doesn't look proper, but I like to give him little feetsies. 
So, how you do that? Is you go down here, do that line down here, up and up. One of these little lines, they're just little things, but these parts are just easy. These little ones right here, just go like this. Little feet. This one's just grab a stick on the edge and point. It's like a shoe. Yeah, that looks bad. I'm, look I'm looking at the camera while I'm drawing that. But yes, now I want to do connect this part here. Do you want to connect from there? Nope. Now you want to grab the ear, go up, and there. Then that should be your friendly Pikachu. First off, I'm pretty sure there's no thing called as a Pika. Um, there's a Pichu, the Pikachu before. Pichu's before it turns into a Pikachu, but that doesn't matter. Now, now I was gonna do the tail, but then the video decided to end on me, the camera. And now I have to film this little video extra. This will be combined in the end, so. Now we just gotta get there. Now it doesn't have to look like this, but I think it looks good. No. This line before wall. If you have had this line before, it will come in handy. And now, here is your Pikachu. <laughs> it looks so, it's so ugly. It almost looks good. Like an ugly good kind of look. Now you're going to want to color it, and I will do this in a second, in three, two, one. Why isn't it working? Oh, I know, the lie. It's the light color. It has to become this one. In three, two, one. Oh, it still isn't working. Oh, found it. The good light. Three, two, one. Now here's, the, now here's the final product. I didn't color his tail. I'll just do that now. Now, you're wondering, wait, first use, why did you use a highlighter? It doesn't look good. And also, I'm a parrot and I'm kind of yellowy green. So I can tell the difference. And also my look at my beak. My beak is the color. But yes. But why does it look bad? It looks ugly. It's got highlighter yellow. Well. My yellow decided to quit on me. And yes. This is a fake Sharpie. It's a knockoff brand. But um. It was here. It's a load of ink on me. No more ink. But also. Yellow. This yellow highlight color can kind of glow in the dark. See that? Now, let's just get rid of that. Now, look how cool that looks. Now, here's it in red. It's more of an orange color. This one looks really cool. And it looks amazing when you see the final result. Let's go through all the colors. This one probably has like the best glow of all them. Um, I think it glows better on camera than it literally does in real life. Life, but the glow is amazing, like you can see. Um, but yeah, that's the first part. Now we got the second how to draw. Now this one's actually really easy since I do this one a lot. Um. And let's begin. So let's swap another page. Why does it sink through? That's good. 
Now, now this one is going to be 5 million times easier for you guys. Now this one is going to be uh, an LPS. Now yes, I do draw LPS. And I commonly do use um, little lines from the inside so it looks better. But today we're going to be differing it and mixing it up. So yes, let's start. Now we need to select our LPS. And today I'm going to be using one of my favourite LPS of all time. Um, we're going to be doing an LPS. So yeah. Um... Hmm. I'm gonna select your LPS now. Okay. I have so many LPS around my desk. What do I choose? <gasps> oh yes. One of my favorites. This guy. I know you guys love him. It's you. I'm kidding. You can be at whatever LPS you want. You can choose any LPS. This um doesn't have to be um a parrot, but yeah, this works for any LPS. So first off. You do the line. Do a line here and there. What do you have? What my name on this? Ah. Oh, I'm just going to switch the pen quickly. I got this one now. I don't want my name being shown on camera. Because I actually had it. So now we've got to do the hairdo. I know you guys love this hairdo. I want to do like, this kind of hairdo. I do do that hairdo. Now the pen's starting to quit on me, so let's use this one who's even going to quit on me more. So we've got to do a line. This looks like a really, kind of like a, um, how do I put it? Birdie thing. Um, kind of like a, ah, forgetting it. I'm just trying to tear my, this. This this thing on one of the pens that's really annoying me. Oh well, um let's use it anyway. Look like this. So now I do a line at that. Now I'm gonna do another expression on this guy. Next we gotta do those kind of goofy eyes. Has a gay LPS. Now if you didn't know this obvious curve has like these, it's looking in different directions. They kind of like follow me eyes on fursuits. If you even know what I'm talking about, that is. So there we go. Now I want to give him some cheeks just because they look cute. Now we're just going to give him. A shaped head. It's got a block head, so this looks really bad. Um, now we got there. Now we just go give him a neck. A little fluff on the sides. Now, of course, guys, this is, I did not put any effort in this. Um, to be honest, I did it. Like, I'm trying to, okay. So, for this video, I tried to copy this guy from starting. But just so you know, guys, I am not good with that. I only draw my art style, and I haven't had much practice with that. It looks like a pigeon. Really bad. But at least he's so bad, he looks good in some cute way. Anyways, that'll be it for the end of the video. And hope you enjoyed. Hope you enjoyed, fans. Wait a second.
Oh, damn, I can't do it. Ah, oh, wait a second. Does this disturb you? Okay, um, that's kind of creepy. Ah, but yes, hope you enjoyed the video. And see you later in more videos. Bye.